welcome back to the channel. I truly appreciate you guys for being here. Um, first off, I just want to say I'm truly sorry for being a little bit absent to this channel. Um, I haven't been neglecting it, but I do want to give you guys a little bit of an update. Um, I am I did just join a mastermind group okay so a business mastermind group which is really going to teach me the keys and you know the the next level strategies in order to build my brand to the next level and to get JG fitness where I can see it the vision that I actually see for all of this so um, I truly appreciate you guys being patient. I'm going to truly, truly try to stick to a one time a week schedule within all this craziness. And then hopefully once this is all over with, really get um, the ball rolling with YouTube and just to give you guys as much content and value as possible. Um, so I just want to hop on here the night before tomorrow. I am going to be doing the video of a full day of eating. So we're going to get right into the video. See you guys tomorrow. Peace. I'm judging you because it is way better than water. So if you haven't tried it out, do it. All right, last bite, guys. Mmm. Simple meal to start the day. Feeling good. Got some carbs in me. Obviously, got to get the caffeine too because if you guys do not have coffee, I'm not sure what you're doing. Comment below if you have coffee and if you love it because I freaking love it. So right after this, going to head to the gym, hit some back and buys, uh, maybe a little bit of shoulders as well. And then after that, I have a photo shoot today to um, record some demo exercise videos for my online program. And then after that, we'll dig into meal two. See you guys later. So I don't know if you guys have watched any of my other past videos, but I do go to Crunch Fitness now. Um, I've never gone there before, but I have been going for like the past month. It's not bad, but um, they have a little bit of an issue when I try to bring the camera in. So I cannot bring the camera in, um, which sucks. So I can't really get a lot of footage of me in the gym, which is okay though, because today is a full day of eating. So it's not the be that big of a deal. But um, I will try to get some things on my phone if possible, like some recordings of me doing some lifts and stuff like that. So just so you guys know, I'm not neglecting it. It's really just because I can't. All right. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Woo! Feeling good. Just crushed that lift, guys. It's the best when you crush a lift and you know you crushed it because now you're ready to freaking have a good day. That's why I stress the importance of actually working out in the morning. I truly think it's super beneficial to have a productive day. Um, we will talk about a morning routine in another video, but go in a house meal number two or breakfast number two, I like to call it. And then after that, um, I have to do a photo shoot like I explained. Then I got some calls for the rest of the day. I'll bring you guys with me. there let's go and now for the best pieces of the recipe okay you have some blueberries we're gonna do a handful of that some low calorie ready whip okay this is kind of like whipped cream guys it's just literally only 15 calories so you want to keep your calories low with stuff like that to flavor your meals up okay and then the last thing I have is this new syrup that I'm trying out. I'm not sure if it's gonna be good, but it's sugar-free, low-calorie syrup. Syrup. It literally only has 10 calories in it, okay? So, when you guys are, you know, putting syrup on your, on your breakfast and stuff like that, try to go for low-calorie. Anything under, like, 20 calories is considered low-calorie, so that's um, gonna be a good alternative here. We're gonna spruce it up and enjoy this. Let's go. So before I house this bad boy right here, I just wanted to give you guys a quick look as to what I'm actually taking uh, supplement wise. I do not take much guys, okay? Because 
I am a firm believer that you need to be getting a lot of your, you know, vitamins, minerals and stuff like that from your actual diet. But what I do take is a probiotic acidophilus. This only has, I believe, a hundred, it says a hundred million organisms. Um, I know you could take like up to like two, three billion a day, um, even more for people that really, really need it. But I just take it for easy gut digestion. So this helps a lot. I take um, one a day with this. And then I also take one scoop of strong reds to get a lot of my fruit intake through here if I'm not eating a lot of fruit throughout the day. But obviously I already had a couple of servings of blueberries and I'm probably gonna have an apple later. Um, and then also I take strong greens to kind of supplement some vegetables in there as well. Um, I don't think this is like completely necessary guys, but if you wanna kind of get your immune system up a little bit and you wanna get a good start to the day, um, check these supplements out. I do really think BPN makes quality products. Uh, but they are a little bit on the more expensive side. So I'm sure you could find something else that works for you. Um, yeah, so let's house this anabolic French toast from Greg Doucet. Forgot to mention that. That is who makes this recipe or who made this recipe. But it's pretty simple. It's not hard to make as you guys saw. Um, so let's dig in. Last three blueberries. Benito, that was good, guys. Okay, this is super simple, low-calorie meal. Try it out. I'm going to put all the ingredients up in this video as well if I already did not do it. Um, just because I want you guys to understand how easy it is to make, you know, nutrient-dense packed meals that are just cheap to make and super simple. So there's really no excuse to be eating like crap on a day-to-day -day basis. There's ways to make it very easy. And yes, I will be honest, <clears throat> being an online fitness coach, I do have more time throughout the day essentially to be able to do these things and focus more on my diet. But guys, this is easy. This takes literally five minutes to make. So, and it's good. Yeah, photo shoot time. Say what's up. Sir, baby, we yeah. out here. So all done with the photo shoot, guys. I have to tell you, that took way longer than I thought. I was doing demo videos, like I said, for my online programming, and I literally did not think I had that many freaking exercises, okay? So I think I ended up taking about 100 and like 10 to 120 videos, and I still have a lot more to get done. So we're going to make it, we're going to do that another day, okay? Because this is just taking too long. So now I'm going to go in, um, make my lunch, okay, today. Now I will say this, I probably would be eating about an hour beforehand. Um, usually I eat lunch around 12 o'clock, but it's already one. Um, I have a call in about 15 minutes and then I'm going to make lunch. So probably around 1.30, 1 1.45, 1 I'll get my next meal in. See you guys then. I don't want to miss anything because it is a full day of eating. And I want to be honest with you guys of what I'm eating. So I am eating an apple right now because I just need something. I'm freaking starving after that photo shoot. Gonna house this, okay? Yes, I already bit into it. I got caught. I was trying to not show you guys this. Oh, well. Uh, so gonna bite into this, guys. Finish this. And then I'm gonna jump on my call for my business. And then after that, make some lunch. Oh, that hurt stubbed my toe all right guys one bite everyone knows the rules that was a, that was a dirty bite but so good. all right guys so it is about five o'clock right now um, normally I would have dinner around like 6 o'clock, but I think I'm going to have dinner a little later today just because this day has been hectic. Um, for the last like three hours, I've been working on my online business, doing a bunch of stuff for clients, um, personalizing programs, all that good stuff. But I love it. So it's like you never work a day in your life if you like what you do, right? It's what they say. So now I'm going to have a little bit of a protein shake, guys, only because I'm a decent amount behind on my protein. Usually I'm eating anywhere from like uh, 170 to 190 grams of protein a day. Um, again, I'm not as strict with my macros. I like fluctuating a little bit. That's just how my body reacts. Um, it's just, it's better that way for me. So I'm not crazy strict with my macros. So gonna have some Vega protein right now. I'm gonna do two scoops of that. Then I'm gonna take some um, Smart Balance peanut butter, okay? This is pretty good stuff, guys. It's 
decently low in fat, which is good. It's not like it has like 30 grams of fat and it's pretty healthy. Um, it's all like natural stuff that they use within this peanut butter. So I'm gonna do a tablespoon of that in my shake. And then I'm also going to do four ounces of Purdue chicken breast. Um, I'm just gonna put that in a pan, you know, put some spices on it and that's it. So bon appetit, let's eat. my shake into this cup because I'm going to my girlfriend's house and I want to be able to drink it on the way so going to be crushing this chicken right after this guys and then once I'm done with that I think we're getting sushi later um, a lot of people call it a cheat meal it's not a cheat meal as long as it fits within those freaking macros guys that is why the wonders of the macros it's super, super important to track your food, understanding how much you're eating on a daily basis. Cannot stress that enough. That is what I teach all my clients as well. So if you are looking for some help in that nature and, and just learning to have a healthy relationship with food, please make sure you drop it in the comments below and I'll, be, and I'll know to actually reach out to you to give you more information regarding my program. Talk to you guys soon. Hey, YouTube, guess who's gonna work out soon? I'm definitely yeah. putting that in the video. So while we're waiting for our sushi to come, we have a nice visitor here. Say what's up, Miley. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you sniffing the camera? Oh no. Oh. We got it. Woo! Secured the bag, let's go. Nothing better than some sushi in bed. So all done for the day, guys. This was literally the last meal. Um, now, usually I don't do sushi every single week, but I will say it is not a cheat meal as long as it fits within your macros, like I said before. So I think I was a little high in carbs today, but that's okay. I'm going to go a little bit lower in protein and then even it out tomorrow. So you could always mess around with your macros to fit it in throughout the week. Um, and that is it guys. So really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I cannot wait for the next video. It should be up next week. I'm thinking about doing a food challenge. So see you guys there. Talk to you guys soon. Peace.